Hi guys, this is Skidflash here, and welcome back to Let's Play Danganronpa 2 Blind in the last part. Oh god, I should, probably should have left some wheelie away there. Um, <laughs> oopsies, but um, so in the last part we were on the, we were on the pursuit, and um, we, were, we were trying to figure out how, uh, you know, how should, uh, um, we, we made an accusation. We, we called out Peko Pekayama. We have reason to believe uh, Fuyuhiko was a co-conspirator. I don't know why you would do that. You can't really get away with shit like that in this world. <laughs> he would still be nailed. But maybe we'll figure out some motive after we finish, like, you know, <laughs> um, catching them. After you climbed out the window, as long as she held up her bag towards her, yes, she would have been able to recover the bamboo sword. Interesting. And see, Fuyuhiko seems, um, like, you know, baffled. They're not baffled, but, uh, I, I can't think of the word. I can't think of any words right now, but, um, but he used both of them, them both to escape. How, um, Akane said that she's just like a ninja, but it's nothing as silly as that. Only Peko could just perform that feat and escape plan hitting of the ultimate swordsman. That's right. Um, I could have, it would have been an even greater plan because every, because he is just a mastermind, I swear. Um, did you really kill my hero? Uh, no, yeah, we're just making assumptions. You don't have any proof. I won't accept this unless there's proof. Oh shit, do we have proof? Thing fell. Um, oh yeah, she's, she, she, she knows her fate. Uh, it's fine. Saying anything more would just be an exercise in futility. Hot damn. Um, we don't have to do anything more? Do we have to do the manga? Is that all we have to do? Peko just admitted it so freely. Okay. At least. Very well. Now let's cast her votes. No, wait, if there's... Yeah, shit. <laughs> Alright, um... Okay, I'm back. Let's confer Shiaki wants to confirm one thing. What <laughs> can it wait after voting? No, you're gonna you're gonna be murked there. It's about Peko's motive. That's an insanely good point. You know, I was thinking off screen because like, you know, I have an insane amount of time to um <laughs> between recording sessions because you know that's just how let's playing rolls. She has no connection to the Twilight Cinder murder case. What if like Peko Peko Yama like isn't her actual name? That's an odd name in the to begin with, but whatever. Um, let's see, if I must answer that question? It was for, oh, okay. For the sake of justice! Seigi no tameni! Um, well damn, are you, are you that one person? Protect the justice of this world. Okay, never mind then. I guess, <laughs> I guess people can have odd names, you know. Um, my hands to satisfy some personal grudges. There's only one reason I kill, for the sake of protecting justice. Does that mean you're that one person? Um... Well, there we go. It's Eternal Sun, the Eternal... Okay. Earth to Peko. Um... The world would immediately freeze and people's smiles would vanish. Oh no. Look at her though. Um... Alrighty then. <laughs> um... Is she Sparkling Sun Witch Esper Ito or whatever the hell... Oh, I'm sorry, I forgot to... Every time I said that name, I forgot to add the star. Those are absolutely necessary. Um... Oh wow, look at that. <laughs> oh god, that was... <laughs> that was sudden... and vexing. But I hear a theme going on, so let's turn up the volume. Oh god, maybe that's a little too hot. Alright. <laughs> oh no, she's talking in emoticons. What have we done? Um. <laughs> My reaction's exactly, Kazuichi. Um. Sparkling justice. Alright. Something about this is just so off. <laughs> it looks so weird. Um. What's this chill? <laughs> you need to chill, man. Alright. Sparkling Justice is a serial killer who claims to be an ally of Justice. Alright. But she only ch targets other criminals, right? So we're fine. We're fine. Okay. But this was a... <laughs> certainly a shock. Um, the mask is a dividing line. It, uh... It's the facade to, uh... <laughs> I, I'm not gonna finish that entire speech. Um... Mostly because I can't, but okay. <laughs> More emoticons. Yeah, this is becoming really crazy. What the heck is this? Why is it turning out like this? Okay, yeah. <laughs> he still doesn't care at all. It's the killer. 
This again? Ah, really? Ah. Um, why did he kill Mahiru? Alright. Um. Alrighty then. I must not overlook evil. Are you saying Mahiru is? Alright, what, what is going on? I was able to find a killer's, the killer's accomplice hiding on the island like a sewer. Oh, that's right. Like the traitor or something, right? Um. Is that? Oh, no, 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 no. The killer's accomplice to that one case. Yeah, and she's, you know, a person of justice. Even though all that is, like, you know, in the past now. They don't even, is that school even up anymore? Come on. She's such a stereotypical psychopath. Uh huh. This is weird. Um, I already forgotten who I am. All right. <laughs> Alrighty then. <laughs> you know when I when I woke up today and decided to oh my god what the hell is a person blinking so much? When I woke up today I wasn't think I wasn't expecting this to go uh, to go down. But you know you, you leave it to Dong and Rampa to be uh weird. We need to end this already. Um, in the end, there's no mistake, it was Ke Peko all along. Let's just go over the incident one more time and end this, okay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure everyone knows who to vote for, but, um, just in case. Alright, what do we have? We have, we got some, uh, chloroform, we got a waking up, my hero talking to someone, footprints in the sand, and water bottles, okay. On the morning of the day, my hero met... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, whatever. But um, in order to learn those are the letters, the first one to arrive at the beach house was whatever. The next one to arrive at the beach house. Oh wait. Um, no, no. Wouldn't that be her talking to someone? Like, she was the first one to arrive at the beach house, but she would be talking to someone, right? Um. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna wing it. No, yeah, that's definitely not it. Okay, um, my hero. <laughs> These, the, the just pictures of my hero. They could be, they, they, they could mean anything. I guess talking to someone. But, um, what did the killer leave next to the body? The, the mask or whatever. Now then, to wash off the blood, water bottles. I got that much. Um, um, where should I hide the suitcases? The first one to who found the body was whatever. Yoko let out of. Oh, wait. Um. But she woke up. Oh, you know what? That's right. Some of these are like false leads. I, for I forgot about that. And I, gotta I should be actually paying attention to the pictures. Um. To retrieve the bamboo sword, I must do this. Okay, and then there's Hiyaki. <laughs> Brilliant. Um. Hiyoko left the sand. Or whatever. And. I should. Where, where, where do you just totally knock him out? Um, you're not doing any of that, are you? Oh, what, really? She got it to the beach house first. I, I guess so. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so I don't need to use this picture, obviously, because that's the exact same. Um, now I just need my. Okay, and see, this is the exact same thing too. So I need her waking up. Um, any right here? He wakes up. Wait, I, I look. Okay, no, I was looking at the wrong, the wrong clue. Um, right? Yeah, there we go. Eh, I wouldn't exactly say that matches so well with the clue, but whatever. Um, the killer left behind that mask, and Mikan arrives at the beach house? When? <laughs> when? Uh, no, that's not what you hide. In the closet after me here, run away. Um, yeah, you left a piece of gummy, right? There we go. To retrieve the bamboo sword, I must do this. Tie this to the bag. Alrighty then. Thing, things are things are shaking up. Yay. Um, made a promise with someone. Eh. Um, would it be this? Yay. See, those are so vague. Um, there are two. Okay, nothing there. In the surfboard case, that's a clue. There we go. Oh, whoops, yeah, no, I, I, we've already established this. She's not the first one to arrive. She was the second person to arrive. Um, where should I hide? In the surfboard cases. Alright, last stock. Cool, we can all do this then. Everything's looking forward. Everything's going good right now. Um, this would be right here. Anything else we need to actually fill in? Yeah, no, right here. <laughs> oh, poor Hyoko. She almost looks like a decent person. 
Oh, <laughs> this is what the creature mode. Okay, whatever. So now we're going into hype mode. The incident began this morning when Hami hired. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Let's not speak so much because I I slur my words so easily. Mm -hmm. Okay, look at her eating gummy bears though. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> um. All right. So they're gonna meet together and they're like, okay. Wasn't that? Wasn't that um? Wasn't that Kaziri who did all that though? I thought at least. Maybe maybe I was wrong. I thought he wrote the letters. No, 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 probably not. Um, by preparing a specific item, they plan to manipulate the two's actions. Alright. <laughs> what a fantastic picture. Um, Alright. I swear, all these these are so like wonderfully written. I, they, they're so cool. I, lo I love these scenes, man. They're hype as shit. I mean, even though we're just, we're just recapping things we already and there's no like huge plot drops because it's all just recap. But like the music and all the shit going down, it's fantastic, man. Uh huh. Okay. After putting Hyoko to sleep, the killer immediately hid inside the closet. So we could frame Hiyoko as the killer, then she gets in. Oh man, we're gonna see an execution today, aren't we? <laughs> oh jeez, I'm not ready for that again. Um, the metal bat was left at the scene of the crime. Oh man, and the pink blood. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, she died instantly, so she probably never knew who killed her. Oh. I mean, I don't know that's a... <laughs> I don't know why that's an all-inducing thing. I mean, it's sad that she died, but... Whatever, um... Then to tamper with the crime scene. Move her around. <laughs> that's creepy. Um... Something similar to a calling card. Alright. I'm trying to see which one I could actually use for a thumbnail, because all of these are spoilerific. One of them must be alright. Um, so they can wash it off. So instead of the shower, they use something else to wash their body off. The stuff. Um, the plastic water bottles. A lot and lot and lot of water bottles. <laughs> Could've just took a dunk in the ocean, I don't think anyone was like even like looking at the beach house. Yeah, that would that would work so well too. I mean, no, you'd probably get blood all over the like the window. But like, who cares if they know how you escape? Uh, I don't know. Actually, both of those are pretty incriminating, I suppose. <sighs> Remind me to stop saying "I suppose" twenty four seven. I say it way too much. All right, so they threw it in the trash can because littering is against the rules. I see. I understand now. Okay, and they couldn't throw it anywhere else. How interesting. After they washed up the blood, they hid in the closet. Okay. Interesting turn of events. But they already emptied it beforehand, and she wakes up, Act 6. So, uh, what a, uh, what a, oh my goodness. Yeah, that's right, that's scary. Um, right in front of her, and she ran the hell away. Because that's some scary stuff, man. And she left footprints, okay. So now, just hop up, hmm? Really, a hmm? That's what you say when you hop out of a surfboard case? I mean, I wouldn't know, I've never hopped out of any surfboard cases, but I'm sure I'd instinctually say hmm if I did it. And she places a, <laughs> a yellow gummy, you drop the ball, man. Uh huh. Because you suck. Alright, or you made a critical error. So couldn't list leaving their footprints in the sand, so they escaped the beach house using a different route. Okay, a small room with a shower room. Alright. So she used her sword bag thing. <laughs> that is pretty badass though. You think you'd snap a bamboo sword. Like I can understand a normal actually no, I couldn't understand a normal sword. That'd probably even be like even harder because like the tip of it is like, you know, edgy and whatnot, it'd be hard to balance, but you know, I guess you're a goddamn ninja, so you can make it work. Uh-huh. That's just all so cool, man. That's, that's a pretty interesting way of escaping, I must say. Um, okay, and then you just come back with your sword. <laughs> I see. But their wet hair and swimsuit didn't dry right away, so there weren't any towels at the beach house, so they said they had been swimming for a while as an excuse. <laughs> no, that's spoiler. Damn it, fucking sword, man. He just blew that for me. Um, 
Isn't that right, Peko Peko Yama? Oh god. How is she gonna be executed, I wonder? Something sword based, no doubt. Uh huh. <laughs> really? We're not done? Yes, we're totally done. You can't just be not done when you do the. It's called climax reasoning. It's the climax. I mean, maybe there's some falling tension, of course, but there's nothing tense inducing. Um. I had done anything to be ashamed of. Yeah, that's right. I punished the evil in the name of justice. Uh huh, let's hurry up and vote so we can freaking kill this weird crazy bitch. Oh no. Justice can never be killed, you should all know that as well. Alright, you must be prepared to throw away something equally important. Uh uh huh. Yeah, what's what is this? Justice. Justice, justice, justice for all, whatever. Um Everyone is crazy. <laughs> um the ultimate hope that can overcome any despair, obviously. And reside within you all and save my life to protect justice. <laughs> that would entail all of us getting killed. No, uh, that's not going on. Yeah. Um, <laughs> a few sacrifices are unavoidable. No, 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 no. Um, so let's just vote an executor. Okay. Yeah, that's right. I'm awake. <laughs> um, but who cares? All right. Let's vote. Such hard pounding excitement. What if he got it all wrong? I mean, obviously we're not. I want to know how Fuyihiko is involved. I mean, obviously, I'd imagine he'd be a little bit ticked off for knowing like someone killed his sister. So I can I, I can understand him helping along. But um, what did he actually do? That's the good part. It didn't look like in that uh, in that whole monologue thing, he didn't really do anything of conspirator. <laughs> Interesting. Um... Okay, what more do we have to do? Oh my goodness. Something about this is definitely strange. Um... However... You're wondering if Peku is really sparkling justice. Oh, that's true. Um... She has a little more passion than that the most. The next her Yeah, okay. So is she actually the serial killer? There's a dis there's a distinct difference between what we know about Sparkling Justice and Pekka, right? Is there? Oh no, don't ask me. Please don't ask me. Um, what is it? Justice complete. The center of justice. Oh yeah, didn't she say the wrong like motto? Is that really it? Sparkling Justice. Okay. Um, an unknown serial killer has a catchphrase. Yeah. Okay. Oh, a journalist. I always thought I didn't. I uh, no, no. I thought she was. I, I thought Peko Peko Yam was an author when I first like you know played this game, but she was the sword person, and she obviously has the skills of swords woman. So uh, you know, I don't think she she is a different ultimate than we think she is. Oh, like she was. It was a different language, so she translated it wrong. Is that what it's it? Um. Oh, okay. Gender, nationality, special ability? No, no, just kidding. Um, what did Sonya just say? Nationality. Yeah, that's right. Because different language and whatnot. Um, in their native language, so I tried to translate it. Okay, what native language is that? You're fluent in everything. It wasn't written in English, right? <laughs> oh, God, this is what happens when you, uh, <laughs> when you bring things over to different countries, that becomes difficult. Um, the magazine I read was written in Spanish. <laughs> okay. <laughs> was no doubt written in Spanish as well. Which means the journalist and Sparkling Love Justice are both from Spain. Dun dun dun, what does that even entail? What does that, what does that even mean? They're from Spain, oh no. That changes everything. Apparently. Hmm. <laughs> Genocide Jack. Um Okay, but that wasn't the case. If so, you're not sparkling justice, so there's no way that there's no way that possible. Okay. Um Or if you sis and you're sparkling justice, can you try saying it that catchphrase in Spanish? She doesn't know no Spanish. Okay, so I don't understand then. <laughs> um Interesting. What's uh? What does that? What? Whoa! Big reveal. 
what's what's my duty as a tool has already been completed in full uh-huh um just as I have what do you mean fulfill this purpose okay so now that you've already cast your vote yeah okay I mean they're screwed anyways what was your purpose just a mere tool for the Kaziryu clan um interesting <laughs> Nigito Komae is like, yeah, I get your crazy logic. Um, what do you mean? I mean, besides Pekko and Hiyoko, someone else is also at the beach house. Yeah, someone, you know. There is proof that it's sad that the killer, the the killer thing tool, the um the yeah. <laughs> I said that so wrong. The body discovery announcement. Yeah, like three people saw it. I mean. He said so earlier, and he was like, "Damn it, Komaeda, stop talking." Those were his, those were his exact words. Um, doesn't include the killer. So it means three people discovered the body, and in the particular place, the killer Pekko is not one of these three. So only Hiyoko and dis uh, Kazuichi discovered the body, but they leave one person out. Okay. Um, by being flexible with his own rules. All right. Um. Am I wrong? Yes, from your basic way you're thinking about it, you're wrong. Then I tell you, you're just a tool. A tool for somebody else! Oh, never mind. <laughs> you are, we are thinking the same thing, you just have a weird way of thinking about it. That person would have to be, would have the strongest motive out of anyone else here, right? Oh, really? Um, where are you, Fuyuhiko? So I mean, he's really behind it, but he's not actually behind it because he did—he did nothing wrong, <laughs> I suppose. Um, the connection between the motive and the incident. Okay, but even if it's the motive, it's just a game, right? There's no reason to believe it, even if it's true. But yeah, there's pictures. Um, the pictures of her sister being killed, and that's also very sad. Where are? Um, no, that's the entrance hall photo. There we go. <laughs> Look at that. Um, but there's no doubt that this game is based on actual events. If you saw the ending prize, the photos. Yeah, didn't we show these to people? No, we didn't actually. Um, actual photos with the scenery cropped out. Interesting. Yeah, and he knew all along, and that's her sister. Um. That's so sad, though. What? That, that's like, how does that happen in like the best school ever? Like, really now? <laughs> Isn't your like aren't you guaranteed success? That was like before like shit hit the fan in the world, wasn't it? Um. All right. Hey, what's that envelope? Yeah. Okay. That happened a while ago. I don't remember that exactly happening, but it did in fact happen. Oh no, he's all sad. <laughs> Oh man, um, if you are shown a photograph of your sister's dead body, you would have no choice to believe it. Okay, that's why you sent those photos to my hero to confirm it. Who cares? Um, yeah, we we already did vote. That's true. Uh huh. Your face though. <laughs> Look at that. Um, no reason to kill. Not even. Okay. I had no motive for killing my hero. No reason to kill. Not even the will to kill. I was simply used as a tool. Okay. What? What? Did, how? What, what? How did Fuyuhiko figure that out? Like, I should ask someone to kill them for me. Like, what? Um. It means I am not the killer. <laughs> Except you are. Um. Yeah, but you, th 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 that's the. That's not how that works. Um. <laughs> you have no aim, cause you're a tool. Oh, but my young master does. Interesting. My young master planned this from the start. Uh huh. That is the truth. Um. That's the problem. Oh, yeah. That means our vote was incorrect. <laughs> no, no, don't pull that shit, man. <laughs> like, no. That's not how that. Like, isn't it like the assassin? Oh shit! In Phoenix, right? They didn't. Uh, who cares? Who cares? Uh, we don't. We <laughs> we don't need any um precedents here. Um, that's nuts. No matter how you look at it, that's completely insane. That is, in fact, insane. Pekko is a legitimate human being. That's true. Um, is wait and see what Monokuma decides. Monokuma just wants to have an execution, man. Come on, let's be real here. 
Oh yes, and I did absolutely dreadful this chapter. Let's see. What do I get? I, I get points for oh, okay B. <laughs> that's 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 a B for bad, of course. Um, I'm in a bind, and what a bind this is. Come on, you know you want to execute someone, Monokuma. <laughs> let's be real here. Um, let's take a quick recess. Oh, good god. You know what? Actually, yes, we will take a quick recess. And in the next part, we'll be discussing, you know, what the hell is going to be going on here. Until then, this has been Skidflash. Oh, Jesus. Um, let me turn this off. Um, until then, this has been Skidflash. Hope you've